guys, I'm just Josh and welcome back to the next episode of Baba Is You. We're gonna try to solve some more puzzles today. The first puzzle I need to solve, however, is how can I simultaneously hate country music and trap music and yet thinks that Old Town Road featuring Billy Ray Cyrus absolutely slaps? You can try to solve that one for me in the comments down below while I attempt to solve episode fall level, le what? Level fall dash eight ghost guard. Uh, is what we're going to attempt to solve today. Uh, it's been a couple days, so I gotta re-familiarize myself with uh, things like tele, uh, aka teleportation. I don't know if you're seeing the amount of text on the screen, <laughs> on the screen, on this ridiculous puzzle. I'm gonna assume we're gonna need this is, so maybe don't push it into the wall. Um, yeah, there's like a lot of stuff here, so allow me to take a nice drink of tea. What kind of tea you may be asking? Uh, green. Azul, as they say uh, down south. That's blue. Um, okay, let's read through some of these conditions and see what we're gonna need to work with here. What is immutable? That's right, he's learned a new word. Well, ghost has flag is immutable. I, I assume that's why this is called ghost guard. And of course, flag is win, so we need to kill the ghost in some way, but we cannot do it ourselves. Ghost is defeat and shut and push. That actually... Foliage is sink though. Oof, big ol' oof, foliage is sink. Ghost is defeat and shut and push. So if we can get to Ghost, we can actually interact with him and set him up the way we want him to. Bob is you had to stop, key is open. Is this not, is key not push? Key is not push, okay. I was gonna say, should this not just be as simple as uh, bringing this key over to yonder, but it's, it's not gonna be that simple. Leaf is telly and rock is push. So, right off the bat, what's the most obvious solution? Well, perhaps not a solution, but we can get rid of the leaves by pushing the rock into it. And then we can teleport in between these two. Now they've given me an is here, which, uh, say it with me, I'm thinking is going to require something along these lines. The only reason I could think they would provide me with the is, unless, no, 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 because uh, Leaf is Telly, so we can't teleport the is out of there. My guess is we're gonna have to do something along these lines that says Rock is Leaf. What would we, what would we possibly want with that information? Well, you silly. That's a great question. <laughs> That's a great question. Um, here's what I'm initially thinking. Let me let me reset this real fast. So clearly, I'm gonna use my mouse pointer. I've kind of I've kind of gone to the the using of the mouse pointer to attempt to explain my thought process rather than just trying to do things, and it kind of helps me work through it a little bit better as well. So we've got this ghost here. The key can never be pushed. The the key will forever. This is the only operator with key, so key's gonna stay here. So what we need to do instead is get the ghost out of here. You see what I'm saying? We need to get the ghost out of here and to the key. What are the ways we can do that? Well, we can't push it out because as you saw right there, let's let's do a quick little demonstration real fast just for the audience at home. Uh, we have this unfortunate corner here that even though we can push the ghost, there's nowhere for the ghost to go. You see what I'm saying? It doesn't really, it doesn't really matter. However, what I will say, the fact that they create this little roundabout area here means it needs to be used in some way. Otherwise, they would have just made, again, everything in this game is deliberate. They would have just made a straight shot here that we could walk in here and do whatever we need to if this wasn't important. So what am I thinking? What is the mad lad thinking? Well, over here we can change Leaf to push if we want to. We could make Leaf is telly and Leaf is push at the exact same time if we so want to. What we could do is take one of these leaves, perhaps this, this one, push it up to here, come over here, push it into here like the far-fetched in the Pokemon Gold Silver Crystal. You need to push the leaf up here, then approach it from this way, push it into this room, push the ghost onto the leaf, teleport him here, and then somehow get the leaf back and put him here. Another possibility is, what if there were three leaves? And as we saw, we have this little is here, which means we can say that rock is leaf, we can say that rock is leaf, this rock will turn into a leaf, and then we have a triple teleporter situation. And my guess is that's gonna be what we're gonna wanna do because we haven't actually 
Everything we've done with teleporters thus far has been two, and so I think this may be the level that introduces us to the concept that maybe, just maybe, you could have three of something. You could have three teleporters and uh, perhaps, you know, the way that it teleports you between them is, so we go here, then we go here, then we go. Okay, I'm not sure exactly how to determine. Is it random? No, cause every, I think it may be random which one it sends you to. Uh, but you see what I'm saying here. So now, obviously, we don't need uh, we don't need rock is push anymore. So we could then take this is push and bring it down here to say that uh, leaf is both telly and push. Now, here's an issue we haven't worked across yet. Now that this is push, can I teleport on it? I can't. So that's a problem. Um, Clearly I've locked myself in here, which is not good. Uh, the biggest issue we haven't worked out is foliage is sync. So anything that we, anything that we push on here, it doesn't matter if we turn, you know, this rock into a leaf and then push the leaf on it, it's gonna disappear because foliage is sync and there's nothing we can do about that. So we're gonna lose one of these. The thing that's tough is we really want to lose this one because if we can keep this one here, somehow get this one out here, push it up here, do this, we can teleport the ghost to here and then I can push him on his merry way. However, I don't see how we get this leaf out of here. So I think we need the three leaf setup. You know what I'm saying? I hope this doesn't turn into one of the puzzles, you know, the puzzle from last time where I've, I've now spoken every, all of my thought process aloud. And in my mind, all that's left to do is put the pieces together. I just don't know. It's like I closed my eyes while attempting to do it. Like I found all of the edge pieces and now I'm gonna blindfold myself as I attempt to put the edge together. You know what I'm saying? So here's a question. How in the world, <clears throat> sorry, didn't mean to cough. How in the world would you get rid of these leaves How in the world would you get rid of those leaves without dying? My, my guess is we're going to need to set up the rock. Hey! Oh, wait, but, but key will never be push. So we could do something like this, where we teleport this here, and then we're gonna say that, uh, that, that rock is actually leaf. We could do something like this, obviously, and it's gonna teleport the key basically infinitely. Yeah, it seems to be random. So now we're teleporting the key. The main issue that you may see there, so we could do this, we could do this, and we could say, you know, good to where I need you to get to, and stay right there. Um, we could then, come back and say that now leaf is push, you know, good stuff. Leaf is, leaf is push, hope, hope you're happy about that. Uh, leaf is now push, but this doesn't work for us because now I cannot teleport. And I've also goofed by making the leaf stuck here. So we can push this on something, but how could I, am I stop or something? Baba is you, how can I, a young boy, how would I be able to get onto the leaf? There has to be a way. There has to be a way for me to get on the leaf. You know what I'm saying? This is not what I meant to do. Hmm. I'm gonna give this one a little bit more thought. I'm not gonna lie, it's stumping me a bit. Even though I think we have all of the elements that we need, the biggest problem like, if we were out here, if I was right here, and leaf was push, then that's easy. The problem is, how do I make leaf push and exit this room? We need to, we need to find a way to simultaneously make leaf into push and leave the room. 
The problem, you know, the, the solution we found for this in the past is to just create a switch using the teleporter and make it so that every other turn it becomes something. You can very clearly see though that text is flowed here, so that is not an option. We can't do that here. This shouldn't be that bad. There's only so many combinations we can do here. We can make rock teleport, but there's only one rock, so that makes no sense. We could turn the rock into a leaf, which gives us three leaves. We can turn the rock into teleport. That doesn't make sense. We can make the leaf push, which again is fantastic, except we can't get out of this room. And we could make the leaves into rocks, which is essentially just the exact same as far as I can see, is that not... Oh, actually, we can't because, uh... We cannot do that because rock and leaf are against the wall, so I cannot, uh... I cannot transpose them. I cannot switch them. So there's only so many things we can do here. It's really just an order of operations question. Um... Hmm... How would I create leaf is push while leaving the room simultaneously? Again, this I'm fairly certain of. I'm pretty sure we're gonna need three of whatever. Which means we don't need Rock is Push anymore. His Push can go live on its own island somewhere. Leaf is still Telly, which is great, but now we have three leaves. What would you then do with this information? Or should we place the Rock on the key first and start the Rock, or start the, the key teleporting every which way? Leaf is open. Leaf is telly. Leaf is of course telly. I messed up royally here by putting push at the very bottom, so let's undo that. I'm gonna take my arms down the up down round. Leaf is telly, and also take me where I need to go. Leaf is push, but there's no way for me to get under this. How in the world would I get under this? Where would we want to put this? <sighs> I feel like there's like a basic concept I'm missing out on, but unfortunately I don't want to just stay here and, and stare at the exact same thing with no solution. So let's see if we can get at least one done today. Let's go for, let's go for leaf chamber instead. I think we're close on level eight. It may just be a matter of giving it a little bit more thought and, and, um, moving some stuff around. Maybe I'll try to figure it out before the end of the episode. Okay, we have, uh, what was this one called? Leaf, uh, leaf chamber. So we need to get to the mushroom. Or fungus, sorry. Key is open. Fungus is shut and pull. The fungus has a flag and the flag is win. Leaf is leaf, so don't even think about changing leaf. Leaf and foliage are both defeats, so don't touch leaves. Okay, but leaves are moved, so the first issue is just trying to traverse this puzzle, which is simple enough. Um, we can also make leaf pull. Key is push. We want key to be pull. Um, so let's, let's do this right off the bat. And we wanna pull this key. I think we wanna pull it right here. The issue is we now want it to go up and down, and even if I say that key is move, it's going to travel left to right, which is not what we want. Um, we need it to go up somehow. Key is now push. What could we possibly do with the leaves here? Here's a question. I don't think this will work, but let's, let's, uh, for the, for the sake of trying, let's make leaves pull. I wanna pull these leaves, and I wanna like set them up so in a way that it like blocks the key, if you know what I'm saying. 
Does that make sense what I'm saying? No, 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 no. You need to go back up. You need to go back up. Okay, you need to stay right there. And you, Mr. Second Leaf, need to come up here. Is there a way? Could I theoretically trap this leaf in here? No, what are you doing? Stop, stop. <laughs> now you're gonna travel up and down. I don't want you to do that. I want you to travel this way. Is there a way to like squeeze? Please stop being an idiot. Is there a way to like squeeze this leaf? Please though. Is there a way to squeeze this leaf? Squeeze the key, I should say, so that when the key moves, it has to move upwards. No, now the leaves just don't move. But what if, say it with me, what if the leaf was push? I mean, it's being pushed, but what if the leaf was pull? How in the world would that work? Well, you know, some plans are better said out loud than actually accomplished. What if leaf was pull? What does that do? And key was push. Now key's gonna get pushed right into the wall, which does nothing. <sighs> Are we reaching that point, boys? <laughs> I mean, all we need to do is get the key going vertically here to touch the fungus. The key needs to be, the key needs to be here. The key needs to move but I don't know how I'm gonna set something up to go vertically while everything's moving all willy-nilly, you know? Cause yeah, I could, can't touch those. Also the key is now just stuck, so we need to get that out of there. Get the, get the key out of there, get the key out of there. I mean, if I set the key up like, I mean, I can't even set it up here. I'd have to set it up on this other side. Give me a lot of room over here. If I were to set the key up like this and have it, the key is gonna move. Let's have the key move kind of autonomously here. The key is gonna move. Can I have the leaves be moving up and down and kind of intercept the key, if that makes sense? But I, I don't know how I would get the leaves to move up and down either because they're only going to... Hmm. Fungus is pull. So if we can create a chain of three pullables here. Oh my God, you idiot. You're, you're extremely dumb. You should make the leaf, you should make the leaves in, oh wait, leaf is leaf, so you can't do that. I was gonna say, just make the leaves into keys and then they don't kill you when you touch them and you can work out a lot more stuff to do here than, than dying. Okay, here's my idea. I'm thinking we need like, look at my mouse cursor. We need like both of these key is pull and leaf is pull. And it needs to be like leaf, key, leaf. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Okay, hold on. So key, get, get situated where I need you to get situated. Come on, come on, come on. And now key, okay, maybe one turn earlier. And now key is pull. Now leaf, I need you to do the exact same thing. Leaf, you're gonna be moved for just a second. Uh, actually, Leaf, you're gonna be push for just a second because I need, I need to get you situated correctly to go the direction that I want you to. And that is, go this way, go this way, create a little chain here. Uh, Leaf, you're gonna be, you're gonna be moved for like one turn. There we go. So now I've created a chain there. Now let's make it so that both of them are pull. 
Leaf is pull and key is pull. Now I should be able to pull this entire. He's using his brain, boys. He's using his brain. Now I can pull this entire stack that way, which is great. Um, and now I need to go back and make it so that these are both move again. That's not what I wanted. Okay, just, just calm down there, just calm down there. No, this is horrible, this is horrible. They need to not move. Okay. No, 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 they need to not move. Break this, break this, then do this. Have the key start moving. No, 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 but it's moving up and down now. Is the flag pull? Flag is not pull, flag is just win and it's not push. So we can't do that. We need to get it completely. Okay, so what we need to do is this. No, 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 no. We need a uh, leaf to be push. And then I need to use some text to push the leaf out of there. I need to push the leaf out of there. I hope I don't end up needing this text. I think I'm done with move. So then I'm gonna push this out of there. The leaf is now free. I'm gonna come grab leaf over here. I'm going to place leaf right here. Then I'm going to make leaf is pull, which by the way, we could have just done this, so I'm an idiot. Um, <laughs> but I can now create a chain to get the fungus completely out. Okay, the fungus is out which is great. Let's, uh, let's get it situated even more where we want it to go. I mean, this is probably as good as we're gonna be able to do. So, fungus is still shut though. So I need, oh, I can pull it wherever I want now. Let's just bring it down here. So now we just need to get the key out. So make leaf push. Crap, I need all of these back. <laughs> I need key is move back. I really just need key is back. Uh, all right, I just need key and move. So do this, followed by this. We're actually gonna solve a puzzle. Key, move, fantastic. Then do, bring this back. Leaf, we're pretty much done with you. Key is, move, until it gets to where we need it to go, which is right there. Then, key is pull, and we're gonna pull the key Okay, now we're just gonna push the key. We're gonna push the key into the fungus. The fungus is going to contain a flag and we are going to take the flag and win. Oh my God, okay, we actually beat one. <laughs> Which makes me feel good. Didn't I just warn last episode? We're gonna get to the point where we're only finishing one episode, uh, one level of thing. I think we're so close on Ghost Guard though. I think we are so close on Ghost Guard. These, these episodes might have to start being 30 minutes just to allot for me enough time to actually do these. I'm trying to think if there's any way for us to teleport the foliage, AKA the leaves. It doesn't seem that there's gonna be any way to do that though because the second anything hits it, it sinks. So it's gonna go away. The only thing that can get across them is float, but we're not gonna be able to make anything else float. Okay, we're gonna do what we did with the last one. And although this is kind of stumping me, I feel bad only solving one puzzle in an episode. So I'm going to play around with these elements a little bit more, maybe stumble, hopefully, <laughs> I should say, stumble upon the random solution to this. And uh, if I do, or if I have like an epiphany, kind of like I did in the last one, even though it then took like 15 more minutes to actually get that level done. If I have some sort of epiphany here, I will bring it back to you. And we're gonna try to get this one done in this episode. Oh boys, 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 boys. I apologize, you probably, 
I I guess I'll ha I'm gonna need to include like the last like five minutes of tinkering not five minutes because it's five minutes of silence but at least like the last little 15 seconds so it's perfect okay is it perfect though it might not be but I think okay okay we lost it let's okay Okay. I'll be honest, I'm a little confused here, but I think I found the solution. So, like I said, the issue in the top left was figuring out a way, I'm gonna, it's gonna be tough to replicate this. The issue in the top left was figuring out a way to make leaf is push and teleport but being able to leave the room at the exact same time. And I eventually found that out. Okay, so let's do this first. I think I'm gonna need to actually ignore what I said. I still think we could make three of these and do the exact same thing, but it might end up being a little bit more difficult. So I'm just gonna do this because it's I figured it out. Let's use this right off the bat because I, I created a situation where rock was no longer push. Now let's see if I can do this <laughs> Let's see if I can replicate the the layout that I did there. So what I basically did was I made Leaf into push by doing something similar to this So leaf is push uh, This isn't a great situation So as you can see right here, I just made leaf push but I'm simultaneously on it at the exact same time so what I did was something like this. I pushed it here. Yes, this is it, this is it. So push it there, push these down, and then push is telly over here. I feel like this isn't the right solution because we still never used this is, but at the very least, this is a solution. I think this should work, let's see. So if you place, so simultaneously, Leaf is going to become teleport and push, but we're also gonna be standing on it, which is going to allow us to teleport, and Leaf is push. So then we have this weird situation where that key is teleporting back and forth in between each one, but we're losing it. So I wonder if we click wait and then push, wait and then push, yes. Okay, okay. Now hold on, you need to wait. Wait, and then push, wait, push, wait, push, wait, push, wait, push. Come here. I told you they wouldn't create this little roundabout area if it wasn't for an extremely specific purpose. And the answer is that it's the only way you can actually solve this puzzle. To here, to here, to here. Oh no. Oh wait, but ghost is push, ghost is push. Hold on, go back, go back. So you need, you need the key here. You need the key right there. You need to push the ghost onto the key and touch the flag and you win. Only, it's it's extremely sad that I'm having to applaud for only solving two puzzles on a single episode of Baba Is You. I gotta say though, I think this may just be the world that we live in now. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna say that we're gonna shoot for one solved puzzle every single episode, but it's kinda, I mean, it's kinda looking like it's gonna be that way, right? I mean, am I crazy? It's also having me rethink. I know when I started this series, I eventually said, hey, we're gonna 100% this series and it's gonna be extremely easy. Don't you worry about a thing. Um, starting to think that might not be the case anymore. 100%ing this game, I'll try. And if I have to, apparently there's like a, um, there's an online hint guide, I wanna say on Steam. It's not a, um, it, it doesn't just tell you the solution, but it gives you, it nudges you in the right direction. It like maybe opens your mind to a, a new line of thinking and reasoning that maybe you didn't consider when initially going into the thing. Oh God, my earbud fell out of my ear. So I'm not saying we'll, I'm not saying we're not gonna 100% the game, but we may need to consult something like that if we do want 100% the game because we're getting to the point where at least in a 30 minute time span, my brain is not getting the job done. <laughs> Um, which is sad. Uh, I was hoping I was just look like a genius for this entire series and instead that genius is uh, very quickly fading, unfortunately. But if you guys did enjoy this episode of Baba's Youth, then, uh, you know, thanks. Appreciate it. It means a lot, man. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you guys next time where we solve one puzzle.